everyone. Have you ever wondered how to use or to make such kind of liquid organic fertilizer? Stay tuned for them. We are on a very interesting how to use very simple innovations to create your organic fertilizer and organic foliar for your farm just see how simple the method is and you can be able to generate the rich super ovaries and organic foliar fertilizer for your farm why buy if you can get for free let's learn more from the process so that we can be able to be producing our organic fertilizer for our farm to increase our food production we protect the soil while increasing household income i'm your host Anne okena hello everyone my name is Diambo fred Diambo fred is uh, here in rongo uh, guri county doing what we call organic farming or we can also call it uh, nutrition sensitive agriculture Diambo Fred is uh, trained to do nutrition, organic agriculture by Sylvia Basket. I'm also trained by OCA, Organic Consumers Alliance, and other bodies. So today I have uh, my organization that is called Organic Green Systems, or we call it Ogres. Ogres, uh, here we do four main things. We ensure that uh, you have a farm that is living or a very healthy farm. We ensure that you, have a very, you eat a very healthy food. Then from there, we now move to health. We ensure that you have a very healthy body, a very uh, healthy uh, uh, home or a very healthy family. We also ensure that we put money inside the pocket of a farmer. How do we do that? We do that by doing agribusiness, especially when we are doing organic agriculture. Today, as you can see, I'm in my, one of my shed nets in uh, Rongo. Uh, when you come to Rongo, you can uh, find us on the way when you are moving to Kodero Bara High School. There is a redeemed gospel church hosting organic green system that is mentoring youths, mentoring women on how to do organic agriculture or nutrition sensitive agriculture. So with me here, I have some of the products that we uh, also uh, do. These ones we were trained by CIMAD and uh, this one here we call it Super Ogres. Super Ogres is a foliar fertilizer at the same time uh, we've added more ingredients here. So it is a foliar fertilizer, it is a seed boost. At the same time, you can also use it to repel uh, uh, pests. And it is natural made out of food. So like this one here, it has a lot, a lot, uh, it has a lot of uh, gases inside it because of its nutritional value. When you look at it like this one, it is producing a lot of gases. Ah, yes. So as you can see, it has a lot of gas. Now the bubbles are now coming up, which means it is made of yeast. If you leave it for some time, it can uh, maybe uh, come out. So this one shows that it is very nutritious. So for you to use this in your plant, this one is two liters. Two liters you can dilute can dilute in 80 liters of water. Then you spray. You can spray it on your mboga, you can spray it on your, veggie, on, on, on your maize and any other crop. And it is pure organic. There is nothing like chemical that is added here that can kill. It is made out of food. Yes. There is also another one here. This one is vermi liquid. The vermi liquid, as you know, in organic agriculture, we don't have anything called waste. We don't waste anything. Now, in organic agriculture, we were told not to waste. 
So now any waste that we get from our mboga, from maybe the fruits that you eaten, we normally put them together in a box that I'm going to show you. Then from there, we tap that liquid. That liquid is what we call vermi liquid. Now what we put inside there are just the uh, uh, earthworms that are eating uh, the uh, peels of the fruits. Then from there, it makes a liquid that looks like this. So this one is for the tea. When you want to use this, you can dilute it into 20 liters. Two liters into 20 liters, then you can now put it. Uh, or This one now you don't spray, but you now feed the roots of your plant using this. Maybe just 15 milliliters after you've diluted. This is how I make my vermi liquid. Uh, all the remains from uh, your kitchen, you ensure that you put them here. The only ones that you don't put here are things like oil, things like garlic, things like onion, and uh, 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 anything that is uh, uh, bitter that will scare them. Now, after putting them here, I have a very small and very simple system. They now come inside here. Now they go inside this uh, 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 kibuyu, then from there I can now harvest. After harvesting, I pack them. Then I sell to my farmers. This is a tea for crops and it fixed. Uh, 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 it is like DAP that we have today. So if you have this and this one and, and, and uh, the other one that is super magro plus uh, uh, of vermi liquid, you have you are all the nutrients that uh, your plant will require. Yes. Yes.